The investigation into what led that officer to shoot and kill Eddie Irizarry in Kensington on Monday is ongoing. Police identified the officer as Mark Dial. He's worked for the department for five years. Dan Snyder spoke with officials who say incidents like this strain already tense relationships between police and the community. I think there's mixed emotions from community. You know, um, I think people are outraged, people are upset. Community members left with questions after the deadly police shooting of Eddie Irizarry in Kensington. Police initially reported Irizarry exited his car and lunged at officers with a knife. But days later, PPD leaders changed the narrative, saying body cam video showed Irizarry never left his vehicle before being shot. Anthony Arachi and the Citizens Police Oversight Commission have been monitoring the investigation. It is not uncommon for most of the information at the outset of any incident to be wrong. Uh, what's uncommon is that it's usually not reported publicly as a, a as a public narrative. Irachi believes the police department was right to try to correct the story as quickly as possible, but acknowledges how that could sit with the public. Community uh, police relations have been troubled in Philadelphia for quite some time. Um, and incidents like these kind of exacerbate those existing difficulties. Now comes the tall task of trying to rebuild that trust. Arachi and Pastor Carl Day, who has spent years forging relationships between police and communities, agree it'll take work. You have to be able to see it on your street corner. You have to be able to see it on your in your neighborhood. I'm urging and imploring officers to please step out your vehicles, speak to the citizens, get to know the people around you, um, and same vice versa. Commissioner Danielle Outlaw hoped on Wednesday their correction could be seen as a first step in rebuilding that trust. I am hoping that, um, you know, our efforts in being transparent is at least a first step in that. I understand the reticence. I understand um, folks not really being sure whether or not they should even trust what we're saying today. Police on Friday said there was no update on the investigation into Irizarry's shooting, saying only the case is active and ongoing. We reached out to attorneys for Officer Dial. We have not heard back. Dan Snyder, CBS News, Philadelphia. Police released a statement to CBS News Philadelphia. It reads in part, quote, we hope that being transparent with the findings of our ongoing investigations, once they have concluded, will help to build trust between residents and police.